That's true, Yara. Oh, come on, Mick, please. That's all I have. Tough. Hold on. About this? Ah, Christ, John. This isn't a pawn shop. Yeah, I know, but look, if you don't have the money by next week, you can sell it. Doesn't look like a knockoff. Where'd you get it? Present to me from someone special. So, how about a fair trade for a bottle of whiskey? Please.
Get up, get up, Calfu. Uh, uh, Hurry up. Uh, <sighs> Look what you did to my flower pot. I'm sorry, I, I, I didn't mean to. I, I have nowhere else. What do you mean you have nowhere else? Do you not have any home to go to? <sighs> do I look like someone has a home? You wouldn't have a cigarette, would you, please? Oh, so you break my flower pot. Now you're looking for cigarettes? Look, I'm really sorry. I, I replace it. At least you have a flower pot to break. Come on. Come with me. Get what? rid of that owl hangover. Come on. Come with me. I'll make you a nice breakfast. Come on. Bathroom is upstairs. I've left clean clothes and extra towels. Have a nice shower. Oh, oh, oh no, wait now, lady. I, I know I broke your flower pot and all that, but I'm not going. Oops. Listen, when is the last time you had an opportunity to have a nice shower? You'll feel so much better. Come on, good lad. Well, that shows what you really should look like. Yeah, I used to have a suit like this once, I think. Well, why don't you now? Oh, for certain reasons. Certain reasons, like what? Like, my business. Do you have a name? John. My name is Breed. And now that you're sitting in my home, having a nice breakfast, in my late husband's suit, now relax. He'd have been delighted to give that to somebody like you, or somebody else in a similar position. He was a very charitable man. He used to say, you know, that he'd give everything away, but he'd never part with me. Seems like a nice man. Oh, he was a good soul. As men go, he's one of the best. You know, when I'm giving things away, that's the reason. It just reminds me of him. Didn't you ever have somebody like that in your life? My wife and kids. And where are they now? I... I lost everything. Money, car, probably the house. 
But are you sure that you've lost everything? Have you tried to get them back? No, um, I felt I let them down. So I left. <laughs> they the better off without me. But you don't know till you try. It's worth a try. Yeah, but... What if they don't have me back, you know? Well, my husband always said he'd never part with me, but he often went to get things back. And I think that you should try and get your family back. Okay, I'll do it. I'll, I'll go and get my family back. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Breed. Talk some sense into you. flare pot for another that made a difference. Your husband will be proud.